Hello and welcome to the 7 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Ajawi. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa returned to Bahrain safely today after a private visit to the United Arab Emirates. And His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa received today UAE's Federal Council member Mohammed bin Salim bin Qardous Al Amri and the Secretary General of Mohammed bin Rashid Tolerance Award Ahmed bin Shabib Al Zahiri on the occasion of their participation in the National Action Charter Conference under the theme the Horizons of Future Sustainable Development and Peace, which is held under the patronage of His Majesty the King and is organized by the Representative Council in cooperation with the International Peace Institute. The conference coincides with Bahrain's celebration of the 17th National Action Charter anniversary. His Majesty welcomed the guests, noting that their participation in the conference reflects the deep-rooted bilateral relations and development of cooperation at all levels. His Majesty hailed the major achievements of the Kingdom under the National Action Charter, which has laid the foundation of the modern state and modernized the regulations, laws and constitutional institutions. His Majesty the King also highlighted the parliamentary and legislative achievements of the Kingdom. His Majesty expressed appreciation and pride in the pioneering role of the UAE in strengthening joint Gulf action, defending Arab and Islamic causes and interests and maintaining the region's security and stability under the leadership of the President of the UAE, His Highness Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nahyan, the Vice President, Prime Minister and Ruler of Dubai, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, and the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi and the Deputy Supreme Commander of the UAE Armed Forces, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan. The meeting was attended by the Chartered Affair of the Embassy of the United Arab Emirates to the Kingdom of Bahrain, Yasser Abdullah Al Naqbi. Under the patronage of the representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports and President of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the Nasser bin Hamad Foundation organized the Spartan Championship, which is one of the leading endurance races in the kingdom. The championship is being held at Bahrain International Circuit. The Spartan race is one of the most challenging and exciting races in the world. His Honor Sheikh Nasser affirmed the importance of organizing such tournaments to improve the skills of the participants. He added that launching such event encourages all members of society to exercise and promote obstacle course races, especially because there is no age restriction. The previous edition of the race witnessed the participation of a large number of contestants and this sport has gained wide popularity in the kingdom his Highness noted that the Foundation is keen on adding more obstacles to increase the level of challenge and excitement of the race. He expressed appreciation to the participants for their outstanding performance. The tournament will continue until tomorrow and it is expected to witness even wider participation. The Ministry of Education participated in the 8th Sharjah International Scout Gathering which was held under the patronage of the United Arab Emirates Supreme Council member and ruler of Sharjah, His Highness Sheikh Dr. Sultan bin Mohammed Al Qasmi. The event was held under the theme Sharjah, the World Book Capital 2019 at the Sharjah Scout Commission with the participation of delegations from 82 countries and around the world. The international camp is a global multicultural scouting event that encompasses different cultures. During the opening ceremony, the ruler of Sharjah visited the pavilion of the Kingdom's Ministry of Education which showcased the activities carried out by the Ministry through the Boy Scouts of Bahrain. The pavilion also shed light on the educational march in Bahrain and the achievements made thanks to the support of the leadership. His Highness was also briefed on the Ministry's developmental projects as well as the activities and programs of the Boy Scouts movement of Bahrain, including community service and the participation in local and international scout camps. Also explained in the pavilion was the youth project that aims to instill the values of voluntary work and patriotism, as well as develop leadership skills. The kingdom was highly praised during the event, and on this occasion, the Minister of Education and President of the Boy Scouts of Bahrain, Dr. Majid bin Ali al naimi handed the ruler of Sharjah a commemorative gift in the shape of the first school of Bahrain, al Hidayah al Khalifiya, which was established in 1919. He also handed him a scout stick with the flags of Bahrain and the U.S., made by the scouts of Bahrain.